Hey everyone, welcome back to another edition of the Better Dispensing video series. I'm Tom Masino, and today we'll be discussing how to choose between an electro pneumatic jet valve versus a piezoelectric jet valve. With our liquid in electro pneumatic jetting valve, we use air pressure to open the valve and both air pressure and spring tension to close the valve, propelling the fluid out of the fluid body. With our Pico Pulse piezoelectric valve, we're using an electric charge to create kinetic energy in the valve to jet the fluid out. So why does this matter? With our piezoelectric technology, you're less influenced by outside sources and variables such as air pressure, which makes it a much more robust and accurate solution. With our pneumatic valves, you can jet micro deposits up to 280 dots per second, but with our piezoelectric valves, you can jet up to 1,000 micro dots per second. That's nearly four times more. Due to the precise control of stroke and small nozzle size, the piezo valve can dispense small deposits of low viscosity fluids with remarkable repeatability with volume as small as 0.5 nanoliters. With that being said, you would typically choose an electro pneumatic jetting valve when you're dispensing high viscosity fluids, typically somewhere around 100,000 centipoys or more. Our PDOT series is suitable for thicker adhesives, lacquers, oils and greases, silicones and fluxes. It is equipped with a force multiplier, allowing it to deposit thicker fluids. Both PDOT and PJET valves are also better suited for larger deposits with nozzle sizes up to 1.4 millimeters. Overall, both technologies play an important role, and choosing the proper one will depend upon the accuracy that you need for the application, the volume of fluid you'll be using, and the type of fluid you'll be using. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to contact us at Nords and EFD. We'll be more than happy to help you out.